Uh, in the past we have been interested in understanding whether visual snow is actually a true medical condition, whether it is unique uh, in comparison to other medical problems such as persistent migraine aura. For that we have uh, interviewed uh, more than 100 patients and we uh, characterize them clinically, ask them many questions and we found out that actually visual snow is indeed a unique syndrome and it is combined with additional visual symptoms. So that is um, after images for example enhanced entoptic phenomena that means that the patients see lots of floaters or little cells uh, running over the retina and also patients have very severe photophobia and problems seeing at night. Uh, using this uh, information we now know that patients really have one condition and um, we now can also say that uh, when we talk to patients and we get information from their symptoms we can truly say that a patient has this syndrome which is called now visual snow syndrome. We now have, uh, based on this research, we, we were able to uh, find criteria for the condition. So uh, based on that we can say patients have visual snow or patients do not have visual snow. And that enables us to, to find a homogeneous group to do research and to help these patients.